Hi, it's Steve. Today we'd like to show you how to change the drain pan on your refrigerator. It's a really easy job. Let me show you how we do it. Now to do this repair, we will need access to the back of the refrigerator. So we're going to need to pull it far enough over that you can get behind it, and we'll also need to disconnect the power. Now that we have clear access to the back of the refrigerator, we need to remove the old drain pan. In a lot of cases, these were glued onto the compressor, but typically the heat of that compressor will dry that glue out. So you usually just need to flex it a little bit, break any bond that may still be remaining. There's also a little release tab on the very top. So when you reach in here on the left-hand side, up close to the top, you'll find a little plastic tab. This plastic tab has a little hook on it, right up close to the center. So if you reach in on the existing one, just pull down on that long extension on that tab. That will release that hook, and you'll be able to slide that whole drip tray to the right. Just reach up inside, find that tab, pull down on it. And we'll slide that all the way to the right. And we can remove and discard the old tray. Now before we slide that new drip pan into place, we'll just take note again of that tab. You note that there's a little channel cut out on the top of that drip tray that that tab sits in. What we need to do is to position that tab so that it goes through the little metal bracket that is in on top of the compressor. Make sure it fits into that little opening. And as we slide it all the way to the left, that little locking tab will engage on it. Now our next step will be to apply some of the cement that is included with that kit. And we'll just put a little coating in around the top edge of that drain pan. Now we'll position that drain pan in the upright position and we're going to line up that tab through that bracket. And as we start to push that into place, you may just reach in behind, make sure that we keep that drain tube up close to the ceiling. Push that tray all the way over to the left until it locks in place. And just verify that that drain tube is sitting up inside of that tray and not down beside it. sure it's fairly level it's making contact with that compressor once the cement dries on that that will hold it firmly in place now we can push the refrigerator back into position we're now ready to plug the refrigerator back in and our repair is complete